Hi everyone, it's Raquel from Cali Scrapping Creations. I wanted to show you two mini albums that I completed called Love Notes. Um, this one, which I'll be showing you first, is a paper bag album. And then this one is a chipboard album. They'll both be listed on my Etsy site either today or tomorrow. Haven't decided when I'm going to be able to do it. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. And if you all aren't familiar with these paper packs, they are the Love Notes from Recollections. They have a really, um, a really nice um, paper pack that is pretty much like vintage browns and reds and everything and I completely just adore it. Alright, so as you can see the front, it has this really, really gorgeous um, fabric flower that I got from Lily's Wholesale um, on Etsy. And here are some, these aren't, our, they aren't wild orchid crafts, but there are some flowers that I gotten from my local scrapbook store. Mm -hmm. um, here's some feather at the top, and then here is some, um, I don't know what this is, I guess it's like pearl trim. <laughs> And um, there are some recollections, bling. And then the title right there says notes. And then there's some wild orchid craft flowers and some wild orchid craft flowers there, as well as bling right there. And then for the binding on the spine, I use Kathy Orders um, duct tape. And I put duct tape on the side. And then I put some of that rub and buff, gold rub and buff on it to make it like that little gold shimmery look. And then here is the back. And then, oh, and then I added some little cute little red feathers right here at the top, um, just to give it a little different look. Oops, sorry. All right, and let me position my camera the right way. All right. All right, so when you open the book, um, you see that there's vintage lace along the side and then there's some tags right here these tags pull out and then um, these tags are pretty much for pictures and each picture photo mat measures about four and a half by six so you have a lot of room to put pictures and then you can journal in the back or you can put photos on the back that I distressed with ink and then um, there's a side ribbon on these two and then there's a flower in the middle um, so for the love notes one I mean it's really classic for you know someone that you love and you want to add photos of your boyfriend or girlfriend or husband or partner or whatever um, and then this it came with the collection is just like a little note um, that was written there and then I put some wild orchid carrot flowers. Oh, and then I put some, um, some, I put some, oh, what is that stuff that makes it shiny? I can't even think of the name of it. But I put that on the um, leaves and on the love. And then here is, uh, this also came in the paper collection as well. And then I just added a wild orchid craft flower. And then this, I was just in love with putting um, paper clips on it. So, this folds up like that and then it folds down like so and this paper clip it represents something on the back and on this side i'm not going to pull out every single one because um it's just a photo mat oh and then i put a little heart little charm on it so this photo mat it measures about seven and a half by eight so you can put a real big photo right here and then a um, huge photo can go on the back as well and this book it took me about a week to complete it I did some of it at work as you know I'm always doing some crafty stuff at work um, but then I finished it f this Friday night and then here is the other tag that comes out on the other side and then right as you can see, can't uh, leave my feathers out. So I put some feathers right there and then some wild orchid craft flowers. Um, and here is a paper clip that's also holding this other side together. And then I just pull that paper clip off and then this also lifts open for more photos. 
and then oh and then this is just the vintage lace that I have and this paper line is so beautiful I mean it pretty much came with like all this little extra stuff and then I just put some of that what's the name of that stuff oh, glossy accents there we go glossy accents <laughs> All right, so I put some glossy accents right along here. Um, this was already like this, and then I put a Primo Rose right there, and then I put some uh, Wild Orchid Craft Flowers there. And then this, it just attaches on there as like a little embellishment. And then you can put the date right here, and then I put some lace. So you can actually put a little small picture here, or just leave it blank and then just journal right there, because here is the tags that come out on the side. And again, I have like a little charm right there. Super cute. And those just stick in the inside. All right. And then on the next page, it's pretty much unison to the first page. It just has, you know, of course, those tags that come out. And then I just put um, some vintage lace on them as well as this one. And then they all have a little pulley. And then this is, this is a felt flower. And then yeah, I just attached a little bling in the middle. And then the back are pretty, pretty blank. So like I said, journaling or photos or anything that you want. Um, and then this, I kind of left this little stick part that comes at the end of the feather on purpose because it, it resembles like, you know, back in like the 1800s, they used to use feathers to write. So I thought that that was super cute. So I just left it like that. And so it was like sort of like, okay, they had just finished writing a note. And then this was the pen that they used. And then here you can actually journal right along here. Here's some wild orchid craft flowers. And then there's some bling. And then on this page, um, this is a love note that came in the collection as well. And then there are some tags on the side. Again, for mo more, more, mo <gasps> more flowers um plenty 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 space for pictures i mean can you imagine i mean like all these can be pictures um even if you would like you can even put picture right here i, I didn't want to cover this up because it was so pretty but i didn't want to cover that up but you can actually put a picture right here as well and then on this side um is also a feather and then this also came in the collection and sorry my tv is so loud i'm watching that movie um let me in it's like a little vampire movie and it's, it just got loud so let me turn it down and right there it says cherish and then this opens up like that so that you can put some photos in there and then it just slaps down like that um and then on this page it just has like little fun little clips that I just put there and this is also in the collection so you can actually write a note or put a small picture there put a small picture there and then this is like isn't this adorable it's like a love note postcard and you can actually write some things and then put a photo on the back and then it gives you all this beautiful space to either put a photo here or just leave it blank and it just enjoy the paper line and then there's some lace on the side again each one of my bags oh it's four bags that i made with this and so each of the bag has two of these little pulleys and see they have that cute little charm there um this page i just left blank because i didn't want to cover the bird i didn't want to cover this up so you can actually just put a photo right here and then on this side um these tags just pull out and here is something that says sweet nothings and it says days of the week so it's saturday sunday monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday and then you can actually put a photo on the back and then these are more photo mats and then i just distressed the back so look at this doesn't look like lace it's not lace it's actually the paper but this is lace right here so that is my love notes paper bag book um, i'm actually going to stop the video here and then i'll show um the other book that i did on another video because it's probably going to be about another 10 minutes because this one's already like nine minutes and something so thank you all for looking if you would like to purchase this book again go to my etsy site and you can purchase it i'll put the link down below you guys have a wonderful sunday bye